me too. What's your thought when all that's going on at the end and you can do nothing about it but sit there and blame me? Uh, I was just praying that the time would run off because I, I didn't really know what was going on at first. And then I saw Peter saying the clock stops. So I was like, oh, maybe one. I was, I didn't want him to shoot those free throws. DJ, how bad did you guys get this one? Very bad. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, we struggling to start. So now we got, I think, like 13 more or something like that. So, yeah. DJ, talking about the defense there on the inbounds that we all were able to create multiple turnovers in the row to kind of get back into it. Well, they kept putting it um, in the corner. That's where we trapped. So we were able to come up with a couple turnovers there late and speed them up, and they didn't handle the pressure very well. Um, a couple times, just they pretty much gave it to us. So uh, we were able to um, capitalize off their turnovers and put us right where we needed to be. Robert, their coach um, gave credit to your wingspan, really, on the inbound for taking away a pass. Could you just speak to that in terms of inbound? Um, um, I feel like that's. That's what I love to do, you know, use my wingspan as far as blocking shots and everything. So on the inbounds, I just, it's still in my head, like I'm getting this, I'm tipping it something. Offensively, it looked like for the last game, you just took some, some longer shots. It was almost like you were told everything was going to be inside those last couple of minutes. Were you guys told that and was that the directive? No, I mean, kind of, but um, we, were, I mean, we were just really trying to attack them, go at them, go to the rim, get fouled, because foul uh, stops the clock and get two free throws. So, I mean, we was just scrambling, looking for the best shot. But, I mean, like, Admiral had a three in the corner after that steal, and so we really wanted that to fall down and help them out, too. You were here last year with DJ. Does this remind you of last year? And, and do you guys like harp back to that to know that this can be that these, these kind of things can happen? Yeah, and um, the Arizona game, we almost had that one on the comeback. So I mean, we know like we're, what we're capable of. I mean, we really just focus and play hard. It's just we got to do that from the beginning. DJ, what do you feel went wrong for you guys to get down by 13 midway through this second second half? What wasn't working? Um, we were missing a lot of easy buckets we should have made, and they were just capitalizing. Um, number got a uh, their big man, um, number one, Yante Maiden. He was just killing us, and um, he's a good player. So um, we struggled with him, but luckily that press, we were able to get it back. DJ, with all the close losses lately, you guys get down 13 in the second half. How do you? How do you dig, it, dig yourself out of it, and, and how did you guys find a way to win this? Uh, really, we just kept believing that um, even though we were down, we could still come back. Um, and we just we just played together, played hard, and the ball bounced our way.